what's going on, good people? Happy Friday, December 8th. I'm Kendra Davant, your host of allthingsonelove.com. What you are about to rock with today, on this Friday, is the first ever full meditation and yoga set presented by me. So the reason I'm doing this is that I have a lot of other MSers who have been asking me how to put yoga and add yoga in the daily routine. What I'm going to do is start with the easy basics that I started with. So what I used to do was go to YouTube, look up yoga for MS, yoga for beginners, and I started with that. What I'm going to show you all first is the first few leg exercises because that's what I started with. My MS started in the legs, all the spasms, the shaking, that jacked up walk. All of that started with me, what I was doing. All, all my stuff started with that. Much better. All my stuff started with that. So when I begin my yoga routine in the morning, what I'm big on is burning white sage. Now the sage has I've slowly grown with. I didn't start yoga with sage, but as I put myself together and learned a few things and accepted that this is the route that I wanted to go with, this whole journey of wellness, this entire mixing and matching of how to do natural things and natural ways to make yourself better, all that I've grown with. So your white sage is typically used for a heal, healing purposes. I started out with the blue sage. It's supposed to bring good energy into the house, maybe bring money into the house, stuff like that. White sage you would burn for healing, obviously. Multiple sclerosis, the autoimmune disease, I'm looking for healing. And then there is black sage, which is supposed to take your meditation and bring your thoughts up to the heavens. We're going to start with white sage because these are going to be healing type of yoga exercises. I have a little mini blow torch. Thank you, Will. I'm going to get that going. It's not about how long I burn the sage. I try to get a good little smoke going, meditate with that. If you wonder what I'm doing, I'm blowing on that sage. To increase the smoke effects. Get the burn going. Remember, as you're meditating, I'm going with breathe in for six seconds, hold it for three seconds, and then you breathe out for nine. Six, three, nine. Breathe in for six, hold it for three, out for nine. That's the entire purpose. That's how I start with. I'm going to do this for a couple of breaths because I know we all have things to go and you're really anxious and you want to see how the yoga works and does it help you. So let me give it a couple of seconds. I'm going to put this thing together. Let me take off my glasses. I like to get into it. Got my sage burning. In for six.
okay, we got that going. I did that for a couple of minutes and remember, the point of meditation is to slow things down. To only focus on your breathing. Get your mind off of the bills. Get your mind off of what hurts. Get your mind off of what may happen next week. You just focus on the breathing. I meditate. I try to get five minutes in. In the setting, I really do my best when I do untimed meditations. The longest I've done with that is um, 18 minutes. I made it 18 minutes a couple of months ago. I have not made it close to 18 minutes since. So, but um, we're going to start with the meditation and get this out the way. And next, we're going to go into those beginning steps of yoga. So, if you're in Philadelphia, Wondering what the Eagles are going to do with that early draft pick. This is the thing that you're going to start with. You're going to try to put your legs as straight as you can. Keep them flat on the floor. And what you want to do is keep your toes pointed up, feet pointed up, and you want to bend the toes towards the camera and bend the toes back towards. So that's one set. Two, three. There it goes, three. Keep, try to keep your back straight as you're sitting, legs straight, toes away to you. That's four, away, two, that's six, toes away, toes to me, seven, toes away. Toes to me, eight. Toes away. Toes to me, nine. Toes away. Toes to me, ten. Toes away. Toes to me, that's eleven. Toes away. Toes to me, twelve. You want to keep your feet pointed up the entire time you're doing this. Next. Point your whole foot away from you, then pull your foot back towards you. So here goes away, two, that's one. Away, two, that's two. If your legs are trying to come up off the floor, yo, that's how it goes, man. We got MS. You want to slowly get better with these muscles and what you can do. Toes away from me, toes to me, that's three. Toes away. Toes to me, four. Keep those legs straight. Toes away. Toes to me, five. Away. Two, six. Toes away. Two, seven. Toes away. Two, eight. Toes away. Two, nine. If you have to use your hands to keep yourself balanced and everything, do that. Because that's the way I started out too. And I am like this a lot. I'm not like this today because I've been doing this for a few years now and I've gotten myself better. Toes away. Toes to me. Eight. Toes away. Two, nine. Two, ten. Stopping on 12 on everything. Stopping on 12. Next step, you're going to take your legs, and spread them a little bit. Yeah, you've heard that before. I know. I know. Next up, point your feet, lay your feet as much as you can to the floor. Now, here's one of the ones I got to hold my hand. I got to hold my whole body up. So, we're going to hold that for 12 seconds. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. You're not even going to point them to the inside and try to lay them down on the floor again. That's one. Four, keep your legs 
Here's on the four. Five, six, seven, eight. Try to keep your body straight. Nine. Ten. You want to sit up as much as possible. Eleven. Twelve. Got it. So we did our toes first. Away. Away. Then we did the whole foot. Then we did them to the outside. Into the inside. So next, the legs are going back together. And what we're going to do is make circles with our feet. Circles with our feet. So 12 circles this way and 12 circles that way. Again, it is best and the better you get, we'll be able to sit up as you do all these exercises. And as you get stronger, you are able to sit up and do the exercise. So when you start out, it's very normal to have to balance yourself, use your arms, everything. And I'm cool with that. There we go. One, two, three, four, big as you can. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Other way, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Ooh. Yeah, those get you going. Twelve with that. Okay. Now we're ready to take the legs. Right. Next exercise we're going to do. Ooh, I'm about to breath a little bit, y'all. I'm going to take this leg, pull it in as much as you can. And remember, you have to balance yourself. You want to keep this one straight to the floor. You're going to reach. For that foot. So you can hold it for 12. So here we go. One. Leg straight. Two. One. Two. Three. Try to keep this foot pointed up. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Oh man, let it go. Swap legs. And if you hear those bones popping, you get feel that muscle getting stretched. That's what it is supposed to do. I'm telling y'all, as you get better, you will see yourself standing more, reaching places that you couldn't reach. As you move, you'll feel it, man. You will feel it. So remember, try to keep this foot pointed up. Grab it. Hold it. Here we go. 12. One, two, three. Try to keep the foot, let the whole leg down to get the floor. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Oh, let that go. You know where we're going next. So you can assume where we're going next. Spread the legs a little bit. And we're going to try to lay this chest. This chest of yours is going to lay on the floor. Hell no, I can't do it this way. But I know I can get there. But exercising by the daily yoga. So I'm going to use my hands, here I go, one, two, keep my feet up, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Yeah, yeah, you should be getting a little bit out of breath. 
That's what it does. People think the yoga is just a stretch. Yo, man, you can build muscles, lose weight, all of that good stuff. Let's tone up the legs together. Remember, you're trying to always keep your feet pointed up. This is a mind thing. This is a multiple sclerosis thing. By thinking those thoughts, by actively holding that foot up, making that muscle stronger, and you having those cells and that, 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 that energy is going to get there, man. You're putting mind to muscle. Here we go. You're going to reach for those ankles. Hold it for the 12 feet pointed up. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Oh, man. Here we go. Yeah. Yeah. Now, at this point, those were the beginning exercises that I would do to get my legs going when I was first started my yoga sets in 2018, and I haven't missed a day since. Every day I just think about yoga. 2019, my bad, 2019, yeah. Here we go now. I'm going to the more advanced stuff. If you want to keep going with me, you keep going with me. If you're ready to stop, you stop because you got to slowly get your body exercises, these motions, these movements. Next up, we're going to pull the feet together. Remember, we do everything for 12 count. Feet together as much as I can. This is about as close as I can get it. When to hold this, use your elbows to push out to the floor and hold it for 12. One, two, Three, keep the back straight. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Legs to the outside. Nine, ten. Back straight. Eleven, twelve. Let that go. All right. Left leg. One leg. Going to take straight. Remember, keep the foot pointed up. The foot has to point up. It's going to fall to the side. It's going to lay to the side. You cannot have multiple sclerosis, and your foot is going to fall and lay to the side. That's the entire point of these exercises and this yoga and how it works. You are actively keeping your mind to it. So here we go. Pull one knee up, one leg straight. Again, you have to use your hands to hold yourself up. Posture do. You want to do this motion right here. One, let's let the butterfly. Two, number 12. Three, four, five, six. Switch the legs up. Now this leg goes straight. Like I'm saying, look, man, I got the multiple sclerosis too. I'm at the primary progressive stages. So I have to use my hands to get my leg in certain starting spots. When I take off, here we go. Keep that foot pointed up. Foot pointed up. Try to keep the back straight. To the outside. One, two, three, four, five, six, 
Man, like you loving it still. Now when you're starting to feel it, good things. Good things. Loving not gonna take this leg. Going to a traditional foot touch the floor. There you go. It's free. Four. Six. Seven. Six. Back straight. Straight, one it up. Move to this left one. So we test the floor. There we go. That's what you want. Two. Man, here we go. We're getting it, people. We're getting it. We're getting it. We are getting it. At this point now, what I'm going to do is check the camera, take a sip of water. So that's like you're close to you. Say slow. We're about to move into doing the back. And other things. Y'all still with me? I can't even tell. I'm gonna have to put on my glasses to see. What I'm also doing is making sure the camera is still recording. Hoping I clicked it on record the right way. But yep. All right. Take a sip of water. I'm gonna keep going. Uh, next, we're going to start working on the back. So, again, be pointed up. Let's take this leg, cross it over, and you're going to twist your body and look back. Hold it foot up. One, two, three, four. That switch legs, pull that knee up, foot pointed 
string up, turn it, put one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Oh. Gotta love it. So what we have done is stretch the feet, start with the toes, we did away from you, back, away, back. And we did the whole foot, away, back, away, back. And we laid the feet up to the outside. Laid the feet to the inside. And we did circles with the feet. And we reversed circles with the feet. And we took this whole leg and we did the up down. Whole leg, up down, holding up, holding up. Pulled our leg up, we did the butterfly. And we did one leg a piece with the butterfly. And we stretched one leg, stretched the other leg. And we did two ways laying our body all the way. All that I have grown with and learned over these two years, four years now. 2000, June 2019 started, and I have not missed a day, any whole year and a half. This journey will be two years, and I'm constantly adding to my yoga repertoire. I started out with six poses. I am now over 40. So that's the leg stuff. I'm not going to keep going because I'm going to work on the rest of my back. I'm going to work on my neck. I'm going to work on my upper body. I'm going to get in the arm. All that type of good stuff. But for y'all, I will see you later. Because I got to stop this one now. Everybody's ready to stop. And if you want more, get with me. Until then, enjoy your project. And I am.